Hey guys, just a quick one today. I want to show you how to make some Lego picture frames. Now, these are very small picture frames and are perfect for your little minifigure scenes. Now, you might have seen one of these in a recent video, but uh, I'm just going to quickly show you how to make one. So, let's do this. So, this picture frame only uses a few parts. Uh, let's have a look and see what we're actually using here. Yeah, that's right, I'm just using a normal Lego trapdoor. And uh, then I'm just using a, a glass or clear panel. And uh, if we just flip this up like that, we can put the a panel on the back here like that. Now we've got a glass frame, which is pretty cool, and it obviously reflects the light. So now we want to go ahead and build the scene. And because we've gone ahead and used one of these trapdoors, we've got a little bit of space here, so we can create a little bit of depth. So in this case, I'm just going to go and put one of these Lego trees on here. And uh, here's my little minifigure person. Now, I'm just going to pop that one in there. And if we turn it around now, we can see that we've got a picture frame. Now, that can just sit on your desk like that. Looks pretty cute. And uh, because of the way that the angle is here, it's just about the right angle for you to see things. Now, that's a pretty easy way to capture the images of your minifigures. So let's go and see what else we can do here. Uh, and this one I've used as a Star Wars theme. And we've got a couple of Star Wars minifigs here. So I've just created a little bit of depth by having one at the front and one at the back. Now you could extend this plate out if you wanted to have a really big scene. But when you put it with a bit of a background, uh, it can change the scene all the time. So that's all I wanted to show you today. It's just a two-piece Lego photo frame. And uh, I think it worked out pretty well. If you had some smaller panels, you could put them inside here. Uh, but uh, the 5x6 are pretty standard size. So, and you might get them in some of the sets you already have. So the other thing with this is when I actually turn it around like that. So when you're walking past it, it turns it into like a 3D picture, which is pretty awesome. Anyway, you could also decorate the frame as well if you wanted to. Maybe a special Christmas theme or something like that. So that's all I've got time for today. I'm working on a lot bigger project, so uh, stay tuned. And don't forget to subscribe. So until next time, it's a bye for now.